Irvin Red Dutton was a man of integrity, ability, and influence who was well respected in the sporting community. During his service in World War I, he took a shrapnel blast to the right leg that was so bad doctors considered amputation. He fortunately recovered and, upon his return to Winnipeg, strengthened his leg by playing in seven local hockey leagues. Red played for the Stanley Cup when his Calgary Tigers met the Montreal Canadiens in 1923. His NHL career spanned 10 years with the Montreal Maroons and New York Americans. After retiring as a player, he coached and managed the New York Americans until the team was disbanded due to World War II. From 1943 to 1946, Mervyn Dutton was president of the NHL. After retiring from the NHL, Red's interest broadened to other sports. He was president of the Calgary Bears semi-professional baseball team in the late 40s, president of the Calgary Stampeder Football Club in the early 1950s, and president of the Calgary Exhibition and Stampede in 1960 and 1961. Red was a key figure in the building of the McMahon Stadium in an amazing 90 days. He's a member of the Hockey Hall of Fame, a recipient of the Order of Canada, and posthumously received the Lester Patrick Award in 1993 for his contribution to hockey in the U.S. 2005 Alberta Sports Hall of Fame inductee, Mervyn Red Dutton.